Hello everyone, welcome to the next episode on Anubhav Learning series. In this series of videos, we will discuss about SAP's conversational AI technique to create chatbots and then integrating this chatbot with our SAP UI5 application. Many of you who have attended my courses on SAP UI5 above on HANA, you have always asked me Anubhav, can you put some lights on creating this intelligent enterprise applications? Is it also possible to include some machine learning capabilities to our UI5 applications? So in this series of videos, we will see how can we utilize so-called robotic process automation as part of our UI5 applications, which are natively built using SAP's conversational AI mechanism. So before we get into developing our first chatbot, in today's video, we will discuss the basics of where the world is moving and what is the advantage of so-called the machine learning supported conversational AI. So let's begin first to understand the process of where the world is moving. The whole world is now moving from a typical enterprise resource planning towards an intelligent enterprise resource planning. So earlier companies used to sell business processes. They used to sell order to cash, procure to pay, these different business processes and that was the main ERP software which was offered by many companies into the market. From there companies have shifted <laughs> along with their customers to something called business process automation. During the business process automation it is actually to speed up your business processes with the help of speedy automation. For example, workflows. If you use workflows, it has a possibility to involve multiple parties which are part of the system at different levels of business process and speeds up your work. <coughs> but in recent days, as you observe, companies are now moving to something called robotic process automation, so-called RPA. How it is possible is because of fifth generation of computers, which has power of artificial intelligence and natural language processing. Now this ERP business is changing quite fast. Most of the companies are trying to reduce the manpower cost and want to transfer this repetitive work and the cost to the robots. So computers are getting more and more smarter these days. The penetration of internet and mobile devices is allowing companies to innovate faster and also allow integration, right integration with their business processes with the help of these robots. So in this series of videos, we'll see how can we build such a small bot, so-called a chat bot, which allows us to also reimagine the world of ERP. So let's look at what exactly the benefits of robotic process automation. The first advantage comes is increased efficiency and compliance. Since there is no manual effort involved, there is no manual intervention involved, you have more, you have better compliance, there are chance, less chances of having human mistakes. It also has enhanced management capabilities because robots and along with machine learning and artificial intelligence has capability to or improve uh, themselves with the help of continuous improvement. The, this also improves the customer experience because customers can get now services 24 by 7. There is no human required to sit in the office hours to support the customers. They can directly talk to a robot and then robot can do the job. It also increases the high degree of flexibility because you can adapt these robots, you can tweak the functionalities based on your needs. Also allows you to scale your solution independent of, uh, independent of human and also it gives you a level of agility. Robots can be deployed faster, they can be changed faster, and they can be part, part of your business process much, much faster as early as possible. You might have seen some examples of robots in the, in the traveling industry, in tours and tourism industry, in hospitality. Also, when you go towards a booking of a, of a flight or a hotel, you would see there's a small bot waiting for you on the websites where you can talk to the bot and get your booking done. So a lot of examples do exist today in the real world where the bots are making your job simple. So what is our use case in this series of videos? 
So what we will be doing is here is my user. His name is Sam and my Sam would want to reset his SAP system password. In order to do that earlier, he used to contact the basis person to find out the right link with the help of that Sam can reset his password. But now by involving robotic process automation as part of the business process, you would see that Sam can reset or get the link of the password to reset 24 by 7 without being dependent on a human which is a basis all right so this will also reduce the manpower cost because you don't have to hire anybody from the basis side to wait and sit and help mr sam to reset his password it's completely fully automated process so what sam says is a hello and on the other side we will have our robot so called our chatbot and then, of course, my robot, first of all, is going to greet Mr. Sam. Hey, how are you? And then Mr. Sam is going to ask the next question. I want to reset my password. The robot would understand the freeze with the help of natural language processing engine, which is part of this conversational AI. Robot understand what Mr. Sam wants to do and respond it with system along with proposals, which makes Mr. Sam's life much easy. Mr. Cham can choose the system provided by the proposals or also can provide the system name straight away into the chat window. I would like to change it in my FES system. The robot immediately sends, extracts out the detail about which system is being, is being proposed to change the password and sends the correct link to Mr. Sam about changing his password. Mr. Sam is a happy guy. Even he's on an airport he can consume this application on mobile devices since we will have an integration with the UI5 application. He can also get his password replaced or changed or reset any point of time. So this will be our use case. In our subsequent video of this series, we will go ahead and learn about basics of creating a bot, which includes creating skills, defining the intents, creating expressions, and then Trigger, defining the triggering conditions, requirements, and actions. So all of these terms we will discuss and create a very basic chatbot. So stay tuned on my channel. Anubo Oberoi signing out. See you in the next video. Goodbye.